as it as it as it's motion there you can see that it gets less and less and less and less and less and then it's back to equilibrium there it's back to zero okay so that basically is simple harmonic motion the object is trying to return back to its equilibrium state okay it's in equilibrium there it's not moving there when we apply a force to it it vibrates up and down okay but each if you take that amplitude if we want to talk to talk about amplitude the amplitude gets smaller and smaller and smaller each time until it returns back to zero back to zero equilibrium so the acceleration of the body is towards a particular point and that point is the equilibrium point and is proportional to its displacement from that point so we talked about displacement and that's basically the distance so the distance the ruler is um, moving from its equilibrium point that displacement it gets less and less okay it's proportional so the force and the displacement is proportional and we can relate all that to this little formula here so the acceleration we've seen that before do you remember our omega that's our angular velocity you know so it's the angular velocity there and s is the displacement now that little minus there just to talk about that there not don't worry too much about it we can use kind of the the modulus or the magnitude really but what that references really is the fact there's your zero equilibrium it goes up there and it goes down there so it's just a direction there so if you take this one as the plus and this is the minus so there's up and down up and down from the zero place okay so it's just to reference the direction there that the uh, object will be moving okay again that formula is in our tables and later on we'll have a look at using that formula okay